When it came to kicking off the Ghost Development Project, we wanted a game changer, something nobody else was doing in the market. My name is Julie Toby Anson, and I am the softball sports marketing manager at Easton. I work closely with professional players, making sure the product is feeling right, performing right, sounding right. You can't get that answer unless you are testing it with athletes that are going to be using this product. I played travel ball in high school, and then of course I played high school softball as well. I was then offered a full scholarship to UCLA, and by my senior year, we ended up winning the national championship. I got an internship with Easton in August of 2010. Working at a company that made product for the sport that I played really felt like an, just a seamless fit for me, and I've been here ever since. Easton makes products for both baseball and softball, and we've been on top for many, many years. When I played travel ball and in high school, I was using Easton because it was the best bat out there. But about five years ago, another brand became kind of the market share leader. Easton recognized that we needed to do something different in bats specifically. We needed to come up with something to gain our market back within the sport. And that's kind of where the ghost development project came aboard. My name is Linda Hunt. I'm an R&D project engineer. I was the main engineer behind the development of the Ghost Bat. I get to work with our test lab, with our prototype engineers, our vice president of R&D, our directors, basically trying to give players awesome bats. My parents were always encouraging us to go out and play. My mom played baseball. So we've been you know, a huge, huge baseball family all throughout my life. I studied applied physics in college, took some mechanical engineering classes, electrical engineering, computer engineering, and then also got a concentration in acoustics, which is sound and vibration, because I really wanted to understand how sports equipment felt in players' hands. I was really enjoying college. I started talking with some of my advisors about what's next for me, and they all steered me towards Easton. So this is our um, composite prototyping lab. My main contribution behind the ghost bat was in the prototyping. We wanted to take everything we knew about bats and kind of throw it out the window. The way bats were currently made at the time, there was a small gap between layers. And so we said, why not make it bigger? Why do we have to do it this way? And so we went through a lot of prototyping. We'll make several of the exact same bat so that we can test them in all different configurations, but also to make sure that it's a repeatable process. We made, I think, 34 revisions. So we made hundreds and hundreds of bats. But of course, we were very, very concerned with how players would perceive this bat because it was so different. So we did probably our most extensive field test we've ever done on any product. So we'll start with the gray and then we'll change to the white, okay? okay? My role with the development of the Ghost Bat was really figuring out what the athlete wanted within this product. So we would test it, allowing the athlete to say what they liked and didn't like about the bat. I like this one, this is good. What do you like about it? It's lighter through the zone. I like the sound of this one better. Yeah. Most. Yeah. Cool. The engineering team came to the table with 34 different prototypes. And within those 34 prototypes, iterations came from the testing. Our goal was to really bring this game changer to life. And sometimes it takes 34 prototypes. When I'm walking by a field and I hear the sound of the ghost bat, it just puts a smile on my face because I created something that players are enjoying. Seeing the ghost bat in the best players' hands in the world is just remarkable. The market and the athletes love this bat, and it truly is the number one bat in the industry right now. I 
absolutely love what I get to do and I love my job. I get to come every day to work, I incorporate my love of softball with my career and my love for science and engineering and work on new challenges to create a product that makes dreams come true for kids all the way through elite athletes. What Linda and the engineering team did on the technology side and what my team did getting it in the athletes' hands has truly made what this Ghost Bat is today. Working within your passion is something that everyone could have the opportunity to do. So if you stick to something that you're passionate about, you can uncover your own Easton story.